dreaming it, planning it, and living it. Oh my gosh, you guys, we are in the new apartment. Hey, you guys, we are in the new apartment and there's so much to catch up on. How'd I get here? The drama once I got here. Um, 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 the movers, the stress and emotions, catch up on the boards. Come on, let's, let's just, it's so much. It's so much, let's get into it, get comfortable. It's gonna be a little bit longer than usual because we have so much to talk about. Come on, let's talk about it. there what is going on friend this is your boy T Angelo we're gonna be talking about my 10-year plan setting goals achieving goals living our goals living life to the fullest of course do me a favor be sure to subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell like the video and be sure to comment we gotta have a conversation and you're gonna have to tell me what you think of the new place <sighs> Let's get right into it. So we are in the new apartment. You have heard me talk about these windows for probably, what, three to four videos now? And they are behind me. Yes, they're pitch black. It's because it's nighttime outside, but they are still gorgeous, okay? It has been so much to get here. As y'all heard me talk about this for, what, a month and a half, two months now? We are finally in my new space, which is exciting. Why so? Because it's the first time I've ever had my own apartment by myself. And this space is over 1,100 square feet. And I was laying here the other day thinking, Tiangelo, it's just you, boo. It's bittersweet because I thought I would still be, you know, house and never. This is where we are. So, um, what's to talk about? So, got the keys on Monday. After I got the keys on Monday, me and one of the agents came over, did a quick walkthrough, looky, looky, quick, quick walkthrough, quick walkthrough, and then she left. And uh... you guys, I have great news. I finally got the new apartment and keys are in hand. They give you a super cute box with your keys in it. Super cute. So I figured we would go up together. So let's walk in to the new apartment so all the beautiful greenery yes yes i have to key in look how the keys come in the box y'all ain't that lovely i love it okay what we're looking at is someone's backyard but this is the living room Whoa! look at all these windows i keep talking about them because i'm still in awe and then that would be the dining area and the kitchen towards the back we're gonna get over there we're gonna get over there this will be the living area fireplace currently they saying you can't put your tv there i youtube how i could put my tv there because that's where i want it don't you think the tv should go right there look at that okay that was the hall where we came down for the front door. Okay, swing it around. And again, you've seen this before, it was full of furniture. So out these windows, it's just people's houses and backyards. No one's gonna come over here, but it's all these beautiful trees blocking so people can't be all up in my business, my business, okay? That's my patio. I don't know what that pink spot is about. I'm gonna talk to them about that. I imagine they don't know what's there. I opened this blind up. So again, it's just so beautiful. A dark gray, almost black cabinetry. And then um, I'm just dropping stuff everywhere. Black appliances in the kitchen area. And it's kind of spacious in here. I'm probably going to get like a little counter or something, a little island or maybe a breakfast nook to put over there. I'm still trying to find my way with that. So then we go down this hallway to our left. We have the washer and dryer over there well i don't have it yet so i'm gonna get the wash and dry but they'll go in here and then as you continue down to our right you have the communal bathroom here okay okay and to what is the master bedroom here again look at these windows not as great as a view but i love windows all this light all this light i'm in love okay beautiful beautiful swing it around Swing it around. Got the master. I mean, the ensuite. 
And again, we saw this is the same apartment you guys saw when I showed you the sample. The difference is this is not the model. Um, because I'm upstairs, um, I don't have the hardwood floor. The model had the hardwood floor. And um, I missed the bedroom. Let me go back. I missed the bedroom. Look at this. That's the other. Look at that. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. I got to make all this work. And so I was getting nervous, and I just stayed prayed up and prayed up. And God said, I got you this far, right? I was like, yeah, you got me. He said, okay, then keep it pushing. So here we are. Okay, so here's the bedroom. This is the guest room, which also work as my office. Okay, and as you see, it had that long, big closet. So I was talking before that the master closet was small, because it is. And then there's the bathroom again. So you kind of have a Jack and Jill bathroom. So you can go from the guest room to the bathroom or from the communal hallway to the bathroom. So you can kind of make a whole circle to get up and through here. Ah! I, so I, I just like when I was here, did I get uber excited like I am right now? Cause I really just love this place. I looked at a number of places. I love space. And so I wanted it to be bigger. And so it's an older building because I want it bigger. But look at these windows, okay? I'm geeked up about windows. I am so geeked up. I've never like lived by myself by myself. Like I've been by myself, but my first apartment, I deal with my sister. My second apartment, I deal with my good girlfriend. And then when she moved out, I got a different roommate. And when he moved out, my brother moved in. And after we moved out, me, Ron and Gerald got a place. And then when we moved out, <laughs> me and Ron bought the house. And so, now that we don't have the house, I get to start by myself, and this is my new place. Ah! I get so excited because um, this is a new journey, but when I tell y'all this shit is no joke, the emotional roller coasters I have to go on from day to day is no fucking joke. Ugh! So I'll keep y'all abreast it. Um, I guess I don't have anything else more to say. There's some hardwood floor in the kitchen. I'm not sure if y'all saw the floor in the kitchen. <laughs> Mommy, look at me, girl. Granny, look at me, girl. <laughs> so let's look out my let's look out the patio. Let's look out the patio. Where is the patio? <clears throat> look at that. That's outside of my patio. This is pretty much the view from everywhere. It is so quiet. I'm going to put a table out here and this will be another working space. I'm excited. A new adventures are underway. I was going to move everything. I still might move everything today. I'm not positively sure. Now, hold on. I turn all these lights on for y'all, okay? So let's get this shit turned off. I'm paying. Hold on. We paying. All the lights are being turned off. <laughs> off. Off. Where's the other? Off. Off. <laughs> I want to try to be able to see this stuff, but I, uh, uh -uh. off. 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 <laughs> Look, and I'm still lit. Try to turn the lights off. Look, it's still lit in here. I'll turn the lights off. But this is super cute, y'all. Okay, that's the fireplace again. I'm gonna walk y'all back out and then I'm gonna get back to work. Should you happen to be in the Houston area, be sure to hit me up. Ooh, it's bright, hold on. And um, I know we can't officially do lunch, but uh, we could do lunch. <laughs> Alrighty guys, let me get back to work. I will talk with you all later. Live life to the fullest, ciao. I was just uber excited. That was the first time I had ever even gone on the patio. So, thank y'all for the experience, okay? Super cute there. I loved it. Um, that was a Facebook Live video that I had done that day, right after I got the keys, really. And so, that was uber exciting. Okay, okay, okay. So, now we're moved in. And so, I ended up staying at my friend's house most of the week still because, um, A, I felt more comfortable. I hadn't brought everything over. 
we'll come back to that still. Let me get to the movers. Okay, so Friday is when the movers came to deliver all of my things. <laughs> it is crazy because I haven't seen the pillows and I haven't seen my couch and I have all kinds of stuff over there. I got, I got stuff, honey. But, um, oh, so the movers came right on time. So professional. They were so on point. They moved everything like in less than two hours. I was so shocked they were done. And going into using movers, I was terrified. If you look online to read reviews about moving companies and you're not paying top dollar, because <laughs> I didn't have no top dollar, okay? I ended up doing a lot of research, found a, 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 a broker who hooked me up with the moving people, and I still was nervous. I was nervous the entire route. I was always communicating with them. I needed them to tell me everything because I didn't want nothing to happen to my things between getting lost or stolen or whatever happens, okay? And I'm happy to say everything is here, and the process was pretty great, I honestly have to say. However, I have a piece of furniture that got chipped. I have another piece of furniture that has like a hole, like a TV stand is wood, and maybe something punctured it. So those two things. And then I have a box with glass stuff that's rattling. And I have a great idea what's in that box, and nothing in it should be rattling. Like, it could be, but I'm going to be really heartbroken based off what's in there, what's broken. So... But other than those things, the move was great. The movers themselves, they again, they rocked it out. They were rock stars. I really enjoyed them. And um, to be honest with you, because I'm always working, like I'm always helping people, I'm always wanting to help people live life to the fullest. And so anytime I get an opportunity, I do so. We end up spending like eight minutes with me coach, or not coaching, but telling them how they needed to get their own YouTube channel going and how they could use their current profession to build their own brand. And they were totally here for it. I recommended a book. They, I think, ordered it on his phone right then and there or whatever. And so we vibed. It was a great time with the movers. They got my stuff in. <sighs> so that was great. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait, stop, pump the brakes, pump it, pump it. Listen, we're going to pause for the cause of getting to part two, okay? So before we move on to part two, take a second, subscribe to the channel, like the video, comment, share, and all that good, good. Oh, I'm having a good time telling y'all about my new place. Are you enjoying it? Great. Post a comment and tell me about it. <laughs> Until next time, I'm your boy, T'Angelo, and you be sure to live life to the fullest. Ciao. Planet and living it.